Hello, I'm Engineer Bart Ricamunda from Ligaspi City, Philippines, and uh, demonstrating to you the use of Big Shots Land Survey Program for Casio FX9 860GSD. Our next lesson is about uh, random shots or computing uh, coordinates of your field data, or you may use this while uh, traversing or getting uh, coordinates so from the big shots main menu you press uh, 9 then you will be asked to enter the station occupied north thing in this case let's say 20,123 execute this thing 20,052.60 execute you will be asked uh, the bearing and azimuth so let's say 142 degrees 14 minutes and 23 seconds so you can enter up to the seconds here then uh, distance 74.009 execute so you have now the coordinates of uh, of that point and the computer or the calculator automatically assigns a side shot number for that then for the same station you can enter again another azimuth in distance let's say 142.1356 execute distance of 37.015 execute so that's again our next uh, uh, coordinate side shot number 12 now let's say you want to go to another station traverse 1 to traverse 2 so you just uh, enter the azimuth in distance azimuth 155.58 distance 62.75 so you have now the coordinates of that station but then that is still a side shot so you have to press x data here x data to convert that into a station so that is now your station number two so from there you can again enter your next data 199.0955 execute distance 94.275 execute so you have side shot number 13 then next 239.5333 okay again you can enter the azimuth in distance for the next uh, station 3 77.16 then convert that into a station press x theta Okay, then uh, you can uh, close your uh, traverse, then exit again. Then to go back to your data entry, press 0, execute. Then station occupied, 0, execute again. Now you can see all the data that you have entered using press F1 for the traverse. So these are not the data that you entered just a while ago. And you can use the editing to recompute the azimuth in distance, the coordinates, northing and the easting. You can have a plotting of the tra of your traverse. Or you can uh, also display the side shots, let's say from side shot 11. So automatically you have entered that here. Now, if you want to rotate that uh, traverse, press 1 then rotate press 6 let's say you want to rotate that by 2 degrees 
and uh, zero 05 minutes execute so your data now here is rotated by two minutes and five uh, two degrees and five minutes okay then you will have a new computation of the coordinates So you have now a computation of the data from the last uh, station. So so you you now have a rotation. If you want to rotate the uh, the side shots, just press this arrow key, this one, the arrow key to the right. So let's say from side shot number eleven, you want to rotate also by uh, two degrees. Okay, rotation is complete. So if you you will notice a new set of coordinates will be displayed from side shot number 11 okay so this is the procedure for random shots computation and rotation of the traverse so again this is engineer Bertri Kamunda you may call me at big shot email me at big shots 1995 at yahoo.com thank you